Once upon a time, there was a beautiful princess named Sirenia. She held rule over the thousands of dugongs in the Asian seas. For she was fair and wise, and everybody loved her for keeping the seas and her kingdom at peace. She even kept her kingdom of sea cows from warring against the squids of Japan. Yes, all the dugongs were happy in her kingdom. One day, a messenger came. I have come to deliver this message for the princess of dugongs. The god promptly delivered the princess's message in the form of a tube worm. Princess, your cousins, the manatees, they need your help. The worm ordered an armada of dolphins with oil barrel chariots to carry the princess of dugongs to the Americas. While passing through the Panama Canal, the dugongs and their Dolphin entourage had to hide behind boats in order to pass. The princess of dugongs met with her cousin, the duke of manatees, and they embraced. Oh, criminy, said the princess. What happened to your back? It's the men from above. Their devices sometimes wound and, well, kill our manatee brothers. Oh, now, look out! He's fled from the man's propeller. But to no avail. Well, cousin, said the princess, do you have any ideas on how to remedy this tragic situation? Well, uh, I was, uh, kind of hoping we could, you know, uh, maybe move in with, with you guys over there, maybe. Oh, cousin, that really wouldn't do at all, said the princess. Since my seas are salt water, and yours are salty and fresh water. Then the princess saw something floating in the water. And she, then she thought there might be another way. You let that bird go, you hear me, Caleb? Oh, but Daddy, you know I can talk to them animals. We'll talk with you, Caleb, said the princess. Wow, it's a dugong. I can tell by your two tusks and that your tail is shaped like a dolphin's where a manatee's is round. Dugong princess, Caleb, and I need your help to save our friends, the manatees. Sure, what can I do? Caleb campaigned to promote manatee awareness and to teach boat drivers about how to spot herds of sea cows. Caleb suggested there also be more parks for the manatees and more patrolmen to enforce the rules of the waterways regarding areas containing manatees. He told them that fishermen can injure the manatee too with hooks and fishing wire. Caleb's message was clear. Just be careful, leave him alone. This was up to the humans. And as the dugong princess sat in her home waters, she did as much as the manatees could do. And all they could do was wait. That was either wait for their own extinction, continued survival.